Hello and welcome to another episode of Farm Simulator 2017 for the PlayStation 4. Today we're on the, back on our map of Goldcrest Valley. What we'll be doing today, we're going to be doing a little bit of cultivating and fertilizing. But before we go do some cultivating, we're going to fertilize this field that already came cultivated on the start of the map. So what I'm going to do, I went ahead and filled up with the fertilizers that came with the map preloaded. We'll be going to start with this field right here. I'm going to turn, let's go ahead and make sure that it hasn't been fertilized yet, so I'm not going to waste any fertilizer and it hasn't. Now, whenever we get animals, we will be doing uh, manure spreading and then plowing that manure into the field so we can get the 100% uh, 100 percent extra harvest that you get for whenever you do your three stages of fertilization and plowing for the last 10 percent so but for right now we'll just go ahead off and start fertilizing this field in the lap last episode I was I was thinking that we might want to buy a third tractor our other tractor that's hooked up to the cultivator right now I think I'm going to save that one as a uh, as a go-to runabout tractor. It just all the equipment on it, except for the trailer, looks super big on it. It just doesn't really match. So what I'll go ahead and do is I'm going to go ahead and get a get the same same type of tractor that we already have, and we're going to get a bigger wheel span on it. Um, I don't know if I'll do double wheels or just wide wheels. I'll probably just do wide wheels, but we'll see when it comes to that. And I'll buy that this episode, but I'll do it off screen so I'm not boring everyone of going through the menu and trying to customize a tractor with what I think looks best. I don't want to have you guys going, oh my goodness, this is going to be just him buying a tractor this whole episode. It's not very f fun for the viewers to watch, and it, honestly, it was probably going to take me a few, few minutes to figure out what exactly what I want to buy. But, as you see, I'll, what I do is, you know, I just go around fertilizing the field. I don't r turn the fertilizer off at the end of the field, one, because I didn't have to pay for this liquid fertilizer. Um, and two, you're not really wasting that much if you turn it on and off. So, this I just go around looping, looping the ends. Now, when it comes to manure and slurry, I'll probably probably still do the same thing that as I do here because hopefully the time we have that we have an abundance of manure and slurry from either our cows or our hogs. One thing that we do need to do is we need to start collecting our eggs because that's just free money. So whenever we have a chance we'll run over there and collect our eggs. Uh, I might do it off screen. I might throw it in on some episodes of us running around scaring the chickens and collecting their eggs so we can get that free money. Well, also I'm, I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to play without uh, skipping time uh, more than times five time. Now what I will do, I will skip the nights so it will be a little bit of fast forwarding there but that will be all off screen and I'll try to stay at around normal normal growth anything like that I just don't want to turn this series into a hundred episode series and not be able to harvest our first field yet so there will be me skipping the time and speeding it up and maybe speeding up the the growth on the plants so we can get to you know the the next stage so we can go ahead and do our next fertilization or our weeding everything like that because I do I don't like to play with a fast a fast growth on the plants because you never know when one fields are going to pop up and you can't get there in time so I do play with a, norm, a normal growth rate on my plants but speaking about animals what I'm going to do on this video is I will be setting up a a survey or not survey but a poll and see what animals we start off first uh, 
sheep are the easiest animals to start off first. All we need to do is get a a mower and some type of either a tractor with a front loader and bucket or a uh what is it called the the trailer that picks up the hop I believe it's called a hopper trailer no the hopper trailer is for green but you guys know what I'm talking about we're, we're probably that'll be more realistic than us mowing the grass and then going with a bucket to pick up for for the sheep but I do want to start playing out what we want to do on animals and if it's either hogs or cows we'll have to set up our fields our these three fields with the three different main grains so we can get some of that into our our silos and then sell the rest and so we can go ahead and, and then buy a new planter so we can get corn and sugar beets because those ho the hogs do take require corn or sugar beets Hogs are a little bit harder. I haven't done them yet. I have done cows and sheep in F FS15, which was pretty easy. All you had to do is keep them watered and fed. Now you have to keep them clean and everything like that. So we might get the uh, the jetty mod for the cleanliness. It all depends on how we want to do that. But also we'll be doing some uh, silage work. We'll be doing some forestry. Um, not anytime soon. We might cut down a couple of trees and cut them into logs and throw them in the back of the trailer or set it up next to the house so we have a nice little wood wood pile for whenever winter came comes around. Which I've seen uh, season mods for the computer, but I just that's one thing that needs to be brought into the console side of the game maybe in FS19 that comes out later this year that they'll have a season type mod on the gameplay and just completed the field I missed one little stripe so I'm gonna go up here and get that last little spot and then what I'll do is I'll go ahead and go off screen and buy our new tractor Alright, and we're back. And I went ahead, bought the same tractor, but I did buy the get the tractor with a bigger wheel setup. We're down to seventeen hundred dollars right now, but we will be making that up and even if we go negative in our account, it's just the first day. So you know episode still episode it is episode two, but we're still on the first day, so we're not it's not that bad. Money's gonna be tight, but as soon as we get these fields cultivated and harvested make sure that we do all three stages of fertilization we'll be good to go and we'll be make, rolling in the money so let's go ahead and we'll start cultivating this field right here and you see this the cultivator looks still a little bit bigger on this tractor but on the other one with this the normal wheel setup it was super big it didn't look realistic at all so I think it looks a little bit more proportionate to the tractor now and what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to do all the jobs myself um, that being I'm not going to try to I'm not going to really hire uh, helpers out in the beginning because one we are running low on money and two it's just it gets really boring whenever you just go around and go all right I'm gonna hire a helper now whenever it comes to harvesting uh, if our whenever we want to put some of the grain into the silo I'll probably get a heart uh, helper going with the harvester and go either sell sell our load that we have or put in the silo and head on back and then finish harvesting myself but I don't want to waste any time while harvesting I want to get get each field done as fast as possible so it will have to come down to probably hiring a helper 
chickens are just to the right here, so I'll have to remind myself later on to make sure I get to collect those eggs because it is free money. That's one thing we really need is extra money. So I probably won't bore you too much with having to watch me just drive back and forth and align with this. So I'll probably make two more passes and we'll probably do a a time warp of me finishing off cultivating both fields and then we'll jump back into the the sprayer and make sure that we have the first stage of fertilization done. I was when I was uh, buying buying the tractor, I was I was thinking to myself that instead of instead of doing three all three stages of fertilization as a as a spray, we should definitely go ahead and purchase the the weeder. So what I'll probably do is this shed that's over to the the left. I'll probably sell that shed. Get some get some money, and we'll probably either depending on how much money we get back, uh, buy or most likely lease a weeder, and then and do the second stage of fertilization as weeding. Now, I do have crop destruction turned on, so hopefully I don't tear up the crops too much. But we'll see whenever we get to that point, and I'll probably be the third maybe fourth episode time when we get to that point I just don't know how fast we'll get to weeding the fields but we will be doing the second stage of fertilization as weeding so like I said I don't want to bore you too much of driving around one so what I'll do here is I'll finish this this little part right here and we'll go ahead and go into our time warp I'll find hopefully I find a decent song and so you're not just watching a video with of me speeding up time and not seeing and not listening to me talk. So I miss a little spot here. I'll go ahead and hit that and I'll go ahead and get the time warp started. There you go, finished both fields almost, just gotta finish this last little strip. I hope you liked the song I picked out. Uh, there wasn't very too many songs, I will be trying to get more songs added to my PlayStation so I'm not having to listen to the same song over and over. Um, if you have any requests on jobs that you want me to do, go ahead and put those down in the comments. Uh, I want to try to start getting my audience more active into it. So. You know, if you want to see me play uh, some Sandy Bay, I can re-download Sandy Bay. Actually, I have re-downloaded Sandy Bay, and I thought about making videos on that too. 
but I just want to make sure that I don't just leave off on one field so I'll probably do two maps at most so depending on what what uh, map you guys like the most I, I really enjoyed Sandy Bay when I was playing it so I think I might go with that one first and go back and restart that that farm out so we'll go ahead and park this here from now and go back and jump into the sprayer we'll finish fertilizing these two fields hopefully I have enough in the in this tractor if not we do have that tank one tank left over there's probably about three quarters of a of a liquid fertilizer pallet left over there and if we run out of that I do have the liquid fertilizer uh, placeable along with the seed placeable too so we'll never run out of, out of fertilizer and seed and instead of us having to all, run all the way over to the store and grab it we'll we have it right here at our at our farm and we can just go right up to it and fill it up and pay right off the bat so we don't have to end up getting another flatbed with with a tractor or a telehandler to load that flatbed up with. So looking down at our time right now, it's about almost 5.30 on our first day. What I'll do is, like I was saying earlier, is I probably won't speed up time yet. I'll probably f try to finish planting all three fields on the first day. Um, real life, you'll see farmers out and about where I grew up in the Midwest and Southern Illinois out to about 10, 11 o'clock at night planting their fields to get everything ready to go for the, that season. So, like I said, I'm not going to fast forward time yet. Once I get done planning, I'll fast forward time, but that'll be next episode. But instead of boring you to death of watching me fertilizing each field, I'm going to go ahead and finish these two fields off screen and I'll see you back whenever we get done with that. Alright, looks like we only got about two more passes to go. This tractor is not really the right size to be doing this, but hey, it's what we all we really need for now. Um, what we'll have to do is probably have to save up and probably get the new Holland sprayer or maybe get a bigger tractor so when we start doing manure or slurry because going about seven miles an hour on these fields is really slow and it's been taking a lot of time so we'll just turn around right here this should be our last pass Oh, we're going to miss a little bit, but we'll come back down and hit that. I was saying, you know, we're going to do three different crops. We're going to be doing canola, uh, wheat, and barley. All the, all our animals need, the, especially the hogs. I'm leaning more towards the hogs. I'll leave that up to, up to you guys if you want to see me do hogs or cows or sheep first, but... I think hogs would be fun. I've never really played with them before, so depending on how many people vote, we'll we'll see what we're, what's going to happen. But let me go ahead and turn around, hit that last little little spot, and be so we can be ready for tomorrow's ep episode of should be. We'll probably go into planting, and as long as the the plants get to the first stage. Then we'll do some weeding also. And if I have to, I'll speed up time to where I'm not having to do everything during nighttime because it's really unrealistic. Especially in in real life. You don't really see farmers out at 1, 2 in the morning playing in their fields. But I hope you enjoyed today's episode. I think I'm going to call that it for the episode 2. If you liked today's video, go ahead and Click the subscribe button if you haven't already subscribed to the channel. Like this video, share it with your friends, and I'll see you next time.